Yeah, Alexi and I have come out this morning for a bit of a wander around the less glamorous side of Kamano. All the railway tracks. But then we've got this massive fort as well. And then we're uh, coming back through in this sort of uh, created world, I suppose, in Kamano into the courtyard of Europe, which is uh, here. And Lexi's window is the circular one up there. Oh, here we go. Next to last day of uh, cycling down to Estegom today, uh, about 30, 32 or 33 miles. Uh, setting out nicely, got a little bit of a tailwind, which is always nice. Very nice, about 15 miles down, and we're back very much alongside the river. So we've uh, come up to the top of this funky little tower. Lovely views of the Danube. It's a bit chillier today, a bit nippy. Well, we briefly had some brand spanking new tarmac on the top of this polder or flood defences. Uh, I think they're probably working their way this way, but we're back to gravel and randomness for a little while. Just be able to see the church at Estegon in the distance, about five miles to go. At least we're on something resembling solid ground. We've made it. This is the last bit of Slovakia for us and that's a church at Estegom. And we're heading over there for some lunch. So, across the bridge from Slovakia into Hungary. Come out for a wander. Just me this evening. And uh, this is Estegom. Danube disappearing distance. It's the bridge we came across earlier and then this is the Kapolina. It's the view from the front of the Basilica. <laughs> the mighty Danube making its way and we're heading off down to the right in that direction tomorrow morning on the last leg of our cycle. And there's the Basilica itself. There's quite a few people up there probably having a bit of a tour and then round and back down to the Danube.